Hello, hello. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How was your day? How was your day today? Very good, teacher. Was good? Okay. Good to know that. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, um, Brenda, Sandra, Natalie, Diana, Americo. Okay, uh, today is June the 22nd, 2023. This is the class 17. Mm -mm, let me see. No, this is the 18, right? This is the class 18. Okay, let me share my screen. Let me... Okay, can you see my my presentation? ¿Sí la pueden ver? Can you hear me? ¿Me escuchan? Yes, teacher. Okay, okay. Okay, welcome Karen, Natalie. Judith, welcome everyone. Okay, let me. Okay, we are good. So, okay, uh, today we have the agenda, lesson objective. We have a, a topic that will be fill out a complaint form later. So we're going to learn today to fill out a complaint form. That means uh, llenar, okay? Llenar una carta, un, un, como un tem, un formato de complaint, okay? So we're going to have reaching practice and conversation, okay? So, at the end of this class, students will be able to write a complaint letter, okay? That is what we are, what you are going to do. Okay, good. I have an activity. I will divide the class in two teams. Voy a dividir la clase en dos grupos. For this activity, I need, I need you open your camera. Okay, because we're going to we're going to do that. Let me see. Uh, how many students do I have at this moment? Let me check. I have nine, I have a, okay, I have 10 students. Welcome. Good evening. Good evening, Robert. Okay, let me see. Griselda, team, you, do you want to be team one or team two? One. Okay, well, Griselda, team one, okay. Robert, do you want to be team one or team two? Team two. Okay, Robert. Sandra, welcome. Do you want to be in the team one or team two? Vamos a hacer dos grupos. ¿Quiere estar en el uno o en el dos? En el two. Okay, Sandra, group two. Evelyn, welcome. Do you want to be in the group in the team one or team two? <laughs> Ah, ok, que tenemos dos grupos. Vamos a hacer, vamos a hacer dos grupos. ¿Quiere estar en el grupo uno o dos? Uno. Ok. Ok, Evelyn. Diana, do you want to be team one or team two? Team one. 
one, teacher. Thin one. Okay. Yeah. Judith. Thin one or thin two? Thin one or thin two, Judith? Two. Okay. Judith, thin two. Brenda, are you there, Brenda? Brenda? Okay, let me read the chat. You did teacher by study yet. Ah, okay, van en transporte. Supongo que Brenda también. Natalie, do you want to be team one or team two? Team two. Okay, Natalie, team two. Karen, one or two? Karen, Patricia? Casi no me escucha por la lluvia. Ok, pero la voy a poner en Team One, ok. Américo, no sé si me va a participar o siempre está de oyente. Américo. No. Ok. Um... ¿En qué consiste la actividad? Ok, I'm going to explain it to you. Is, this is just one example, ok? I'm going to, you are going to tell me one number. Me van a decir un número. I'm going to select the number. For example, number one. Eraser. No, you have to go, you have to go, I don't know where you have an eraser, but you have to go to look for one and you will show that item in the camera, okay? Me lo van a mostrar en la cámara. And en el team que lo muestre primero, gana punto. Oh. <laughs> okay, do you have one? This is just just an example, okay? But vamos a no. Eh, sorry, sorry, no entendí. Okay, el team que tenga ese objeto me lo va a mostrar. Por ejemplo, yo tengo aquí un eraser, okay? I will show that to you. Okay, y quien lo y quien lo tenga, el team que tenga primero el objeto gana punto. Okay. No, déjeme ver. Ok, yo le voy a decir, vaya, oportunidad para Team One ganar este, el, el borrador. Digo, llevar el objeto. Y el Team One no lo tiene. Entonces va a perder los puntos y se van a pasar el Team Two. Ok, let me see. Um, ¿Están listos? Vamos a comenzar. Ok. Vamos a jugar de silencio. Ok. Team one. Vamos a empezar con el team one. Which number do you want? Vamos a ver. Which number do you want? Eight. Number eight. Ok. A marker. ¿Me puede ayudar el team one? ¿Quién, quién, quién sea? Okay, you need to show a marker. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Marker. Okay, Diana, good job. Okay, muy bien. Okay. Okay. You win 15 points here. Okay. For team two. Robert, give me a number. Hello. Um, number 12. Number 12. Needle, do you remember what is a needle? Yes. 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 Do you have it? 
Oh, do you have it, Robert? Oh, okay. Okay, ya yeah, la tiene. Good. Okay, 15 points for team, for team two. Okay, very good. Now, team, team one. Uh, Evelyn, give me a number. Uh, six. Six. Lupin. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, good. It's good. Uh, okay, you have 30 points. Uh, two. Sandra, give me a number. Which number, Sandra? Tiene, tiene mute. Number five. Number five. Bueno. Mm. No tengo una camisa, ¿por qué? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, Diana, Diana has it. Diana, okay, Cristina. Pero no, 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 You did? Four. Four, okay. Scissors. <laughs> okay, Evelyn. Yes, Evelyn, you are in the team one. Okay, scissors. Okay. Uh, entonces no se lo ganó el team two. Sorry. <laughs> No points. Evelyn tiene todo listo. <laughs> okay, Karen. Give me a number, Karen. You are in, in team one, Karen. Give me a number. Okay, Judith, la vamos a incluir. ¿Qué, ¿En qué team se quiere ir? ¿En el uno o el dos? One, team one or team two, Judith? Dicho, pero voy camino a mi casa y no llevo nada para participar. Ah, no, perdón, perdón. Eh, hay de es, uh, perdón, Judith. Judith, usted va en el team two. It's okay. Hay de, do you want to go team one or team two? One? Sí. ¿Quiere ir con el uno o el dos? El uno. Number one, okay. Ahí te. ¿A quién más no ha incluido que ya está listo? Selena. Mm. Team one or team two? Two, pero no sé qué están haciendo. Okay. Está, eh, están seleccionando un número y si tiene el objeto que sale ahí, eh, gana puntos. Si no, pierde. Puntos. Ok. okay. okay. Uh, Natalie. Data list and then this. Okay. Good. We're going to continue. Team two, Selena, give me a number. Seven. Seven. Okay. Recuerdense que el team que, que, que muestre, the team that shows, uh, the team that shows uh, the item first will win, okay? No pierde. Okay, seven. Uh -huh. Sunglasses. Okay. Pero de lentes de sol. Sunglasses. Okay. 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 Natalie. No, Selena. Entonces no le da, no, no recibe puntos el T2. Ok. 
Let me see. Okay, Griselda again, give me a number. One or one. Do you know what is a lead? Lead. Pierce. Una hoja. No. Una hoja. No. Una hoja de árbol. Una hoja. Aquí está. Hoja así. Hoja de. No, no, no. Es de árbol. Aquí, oh. teacher. Diana. Ay, teacher. <risa> Okay, good. <laughs> okay, you have 15 points, Diana, because you are in team one. Okay, good. Team two. What is team two? Okay, team two, Robert, give me a number. Uh huh. Number 10. Okay. Nail clipper. Nail clipper. No, no, no. ¿Qué es eso? Nail clipper. Una corta uña, yo una lima. Teacher, ya lo tengo. Sí, Zelda. Sí. Okay, Grisel. You are in team one. No, team two. No, no, no. No reciben puntos. Atrás de la puerta. Okay, team one again. Atrás de la puerta. Atrás de la puerta. Tabla. Tabla. No puedo jugar con una tabla que está así. Give me a number. Evelyn, un, un nombre. Oh, un nombre. 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 Yo tengo un centavo. Ok. Griselda. Ok. Good. You are in team one. Okay. Oh, so sorry. Team one. Team two. Ok, team two. Uh, Sandra, give me a, give me a number. Uh, Team three. Number three. Number three. Okay. Again. I don't think no, 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 it's a baby. It's el mismo. It's el mismo. Ya lo ganamos. Aquí está. Aquí está. Aquí está. Okay. Okay. Los cambian Sorry, en el team. banco, los centavos. Sí. Sorry, sí. No, el Tintu no, no recibe puntos entonces porque no lo, te, no lo tenía. Ok, again, Tin One. Give me a number. Ok, el Tin One. Ahí de, give me a number. Two. Two. Mm -hmm. Recuerden que quien, quien lo muestre gana, si no, no gana. Play. That is a, what is a plate? Plato. 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 Okay, who saw it first? ¿Quién lo mostró primero? Robert. Robert, fue verdad. Okay. Okay, team one, don't re no, no van a recibir puntos hoy. Pero no sé cómo agregárselos aquí al team two. Okay, no recibe puntos el team one, pero el team two eh, tampoco recibe. Okay, pero... 
porque no, no se pueden agregar acá, pero... Ah, si, o sea, si pierde el team one, no recibe, ¿ok? Y el team two, tampoco recibe, pero, pero se eh, queda con los puntos que ya tenía, ¿ok? Solo se pierde el punto. Ok, team, team two, give me a number. So, uh, someone? Alguien que me dé un número. Sandra, Robert, Judith, Natalie. Delta, Evan, Indiana, Karen, are there? You are in team one. Give me a number. 13. 13. Cell phone charger. Do you know what is that? Here. Ajá, pero no lo veo. Aquí, aquí. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, good. Okay. So, se los agrego los 15 puntos en you have... You have uh, 45 in T2. My teacher. Okay. Okay, and, and finally, T2, uh, let, me, let me see what you have, T2. Please. Okay, the Harley. The Harley. Javis. <laughs> okay, Griselda, from team one. Okay. Good. Team two doesn't have it, okay? Team one win, okay? <laughs> Good. Did you like it? Vamos a jugar otra vez otro día, otro, pero con otros objetos, ¿ok? Ok, good. It is just to learn vocabulary. Para aprender vocabulario está bien chido este juego. Ok, let me see. We're going to continue. Vamos a continuar. Ok. Fill out a complaint form, okay? Do you ever complain about the broken item at your workplace? Do you ever fill a complaint form? Complain means quejarse, okay? When you, when you complain, cuando ustedes ponen una queja, that is in a written form or, or just oral? ¿Le escriben, llenan una forma, o solo, di, solo lo dicen? Oralmente, así oral, lo reporto. Do you have to do it by doing writing a letter or no? No? Yes or no? Lo decimos, teacher. Ah, okay, okay. Only you say, okay. But today we're going to learn how to com how to write a letter, okay? Para hacer como un complaint, vamos a aprender cómo escribir una carta, okay? About complaint. Before we continue, let me take the attendance, okay? Uh, Astrid, no está Astrid. Uh, Aide. Presente. Brenda. La veo que está Selina. Presente, che. Ok, Diana. Presente, che. Thank you, Diana. Evelyn. Presente. Griselda. Here. Ok, Karen. Isabel. Karen, la veo. Isabel. 
Isabel, no, ¿verdad? No está Isabel. Okay, Isabel. Sí. Y... <coughs> También está Américo, Ma... okay. Natalie. Present teacher. Okay, Robert. Present. Sandra. Present. Wendy. Present teacher. Xiomara. Xiomara. Yanira. Present teacher. Thank you, Yanira. Xiomara no está, ¿verdad? No. Ok. Ok, well, thank you so much for the ones that are, that are here. Ok, I, uh, I really appreciate that you are here today. Ok, um, fill out complaint forms. We are going to read this paragraph about this dialogue about complaints. Ok, who wants to read that? Only read the conversation, okay? Y las dos preguntas las vamos a hacer at the end. These are two questions. We are going to discuss them at the end. I need two volunteers, but let me read it for you. It says, it is between Mike and Maria. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa, and I need to file a complaint about the word terminal computer. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and I didn't turn on today. And it didn't turn on today, okay? Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You are welcome. Okay, then we have two questions that we are going to discuss later. What expression does Mike use to show solution in progress? And what seems to be the problem with the computer? Okay, who wants to be volunteer? Who wants to be Mike? And who wants to be Mary? Mary Maria? Raise your hands. Okay, Griselda. Who else? King Matt. Uh huh. Volunteers. <coughs> okay, and Robert. Thank you so much, Robert. <coughs> okay, uh, Grisel Gris will be Maria and Robert will be Mike. Go ahead. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal computer. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Thank you so much, both of you. Who else? Who else? Get it. Uh, participate and um, practice pronunciation. Yo teacher. Yo teacher. Okay. Aide and Sandra. Okay, Sandra, you will be Mike and I then will be Mary. Go ahead. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to to lie a complaint about my work terminal computer. I'm sorry to hear that that please this me acuerdo. Describe, describe the problem. 
It was very long yesterday. And it didn't turn on today. Let me see. Someone wash a complaint for we, we can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You your art will come. You're welcome. You're okay. Welcome. Mm -hmm. Okay. Repeat this. File. 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 Okay. Uh-huh. Slow. It's slow. Slow. Okay. Very good. I need to file a complaint. Significa que quiere poner un complaint. Okay. Que quede como eh, guardado, grabado ese complaint. Okay. Uh, como en un documento. Okay. Who else wants to practice? Thank you, both of you. ¿Quién más quiere practicar? Mi teacher. Who? Oh, sorry. Raise your hand. Levanta la manita que no, no vi quién dijo. Me. Okay, Natalie. Thank you, Natalie. Who else? Who wants to participate with Natalie? Me, teacher. Please. Okay. Natalie, you will be Mike. And Judith will be Marie. Go ahead. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello. My name is Maria Ochoa, and I need to fill a complaint about my work terminal computer. I am sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday, and, and it did not turn on today. Let me sing song with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. We can send, okay? Send. Podemos enviar. Send, okay? Okay, we're going to answer the questions. What, ex what expression does my use to show solution in progress? La solución en progreso. ¿Qué dijo Mike? ¿Qué expresiones dijo? Ajá. Uh, uh, we can send a new computer. Mm -hmm. We can send a new computer in, to, in no time, okay? Uh -huh. uh, what else? Let me send someone with a complaint form, okay? That is also part of the solution, okay? Porque va a enviar a alguien con una, con una complaint form para que la llene también. Okay? That is part of the solution. What seems to be the problem with the computer? Huh? No, falla. Falla. Uh, the uh, computer it, was, it was really uh, slow. It's very slow. Mm -hmm. It is slow and slow. didn't turn on today. No encendió, ¿verdad? Didn't turn on today. Okay. That is the problem with the computer. Good job. Okay, good. Well, now we're going to continue. Look at this. We are going to identify, vamos a identificar las partes de una carta. 
Aha, uh -huh. which one do you think that will be first? Uh huh. Probably the date. 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 Uh mm -hmm. Name and address of. Name and address. Date. The recipient, right? Date. What will be the second? Will be the date. Okay. The first. First is the date. Then name, address, and recipient of recipient. Name and address of recipient. You think that is the correct? <clears throat> Sender name. Eso sería hasta el final. Right? Sender address. Al inicio o al final. Sender address. Sender is who is sending the, the letter. Al inicio. Okay, the greeting, <clears throat> greeting means saludo. Okay, dear Mr. Chapman or dear Sir Madame. Okay. After the greeting, what will be next? What do you think? Parrafo, read for write, writing. Paragraph? Paragraph one. Mm -hmm. Reasons for writing? This one? Yes. Reason for writing, okay. <clears throat> After the reason for writing, the problem. The problem. Okay, what is the problem? What what you want to blue. The problem. Okay, the problem. After the problem? You want to read to you to do. What you want the reader to do? They read it to do. Okay. After that. <clears throat> Close a polite way to end a letter. Close a polite way and end the letter. Vamos a terminar ahí la razón. And then, we have two missing, mm -hmm. sender address, and we have sign of your, sincerely, your faithfully. Faithfully. That will be there, right? Mm -mm -mm. And the sender address, which one do you think? The sender address is uh, mi dirección. La, o sea, yo soy el sender, yo la estoy enviando. Mi dirección va a ir al inicio o al final. What do you think? Um, al final. Al final. <laughs> My address. Al inicio o no? Probably it could be here. Supongamos que es ahí. Sender address. Okay. Sender address. Entonces este sería. Al final. No, the name of the recipient. Mm, okay. And the greeting will be here. And then will be here the reason of the writing. The problem. Mm -hmm. 
paragraph what you want to do, what you want the reader to do. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to close it. Let me see if that is a, if that is the way that it should be. Vamos a ver. We're going to check. <laughs> okay. Show okay. answer. Okay, entonces significa que primero va la la va a descender address y después va el día. Ajá, mm -hmm. por ejemplo, San Salvador, 20, June 22nd. Por eso tiene que ser primero sender address, la, mi dirección, que yo soy en San Salvador, San Salvador, and then the, the date, San Salvador, June 22nd. And then you, you start writing the other parts. Okay. Take note, tome nota de esto, okay? Um, okay, we're going to do it again. O la vamos a corregir, ya está corregida. Who wants to read the, the parts of the letter? ¿Quién me las quiere leer? Uh -huh. Volunteers to read it? Volunteers, do you have questions about vocabulary? Tienen preguntas del vocabulario? Please let me know. Okay, number one will be standard address. Number two, date. Number three, name of the address of the recipient. Si yo, digamos que yo se la estoy enviando a Robert. Le voy a poner Robert. Ok, here. Uh, and then reading will be good morning or good day, Mr. Robert. Ok, and then the reason for para, the, the reason for writing. My reason to write in this letter to you is because I want to complain about my computer. My computer is not working. Okay, then para, paragraph, the problem, aha, uh -huh, the problem. Okay, my computer is not working because uh, it doesn't turn on or it has a red line. I don't know, you will describe the problem. And then what do you want the reader to do? Okay, la persona que lo está leyendo, that is the reader. So I want a new computer. I want that you send me a new computer. Uh -huh. And then close polite wait. Cerrarla con una forma respetuosa, okay? I would really appreciate that you, uh, that you send me a new computer. Um, thank you so much. And then at the end, Okay, sincerely, my name, edit here. And that's it, and that will be the, like the part of the letters, okay? <clears throat> Let me take a screenshot. Vamos a ver a leer una screenshot. Sí, pero está cayendo totalmente eléctrica. Ah. ¿A dónde? ¿Brenda? Sí. Sorry, sorry about that, Brenda. Has been Ay, raining. Si es que me escucharon rayos que aquí ha caído. Sorry about that. It has been raining here too. Ha estado lloviendo aquí. Ya pasó la lluvia, pero it was raining. Ay, no. Aquí, aquí solo es la tormenta eléctrica. Y yo aquí con una gran calor. Que nos mande un poco de, de agua, Brenda, va. 
No, sí. dice, si no está cayendo agua, si solo son los grandes rayazos, si está cayendo. Oh, it is just. <laughs> ok, no water yet, solo es, es viento. Ok, so we're going to continue. <clears throat> Dear Sir o oh Madame, <clears throat> vayan el saludo. Dear Sir o oh Madame, after that, uh, which one do you think that is here? ¿Qué sería aquí? I. Complacing. Mm -hmm. I am writing, right? Estoy escribiendo. I write. No me he ido al link. Dear Sir, dear Sir or Madame. I am writing uh -huh, to to have complain to complain about the terrible meal mm -hmm. right Lining. I, I will we, we'll write no, I have. I have had. I, I have, have had. had. Mm -hmm. Okay. Que yo tu, o la, la, the terrible meal. Do you know what is meal, right? Comida. Terrible mm -hmm. meal that I have had in your restaurant. Okay. So he's complaining because the meal was not good. <clears throat> that is a that is a way to to start a complaint. Es una forma de comenzar un complaint, okay? Let me submit the answer. Mm. No. Okay, so in that case was had only had. Let me see. Let me restart this. Voy a iniciar otra vez. I am writing to complain to complain about the terrible meal I had in your restaurant. Uh -huh. que yo tuve en su restaurante. Uh -huh. Aquí cómo sería? I I went I went there with my family last Saturday night. Celebrate my birthday. My birthday. However, the meal. Uh -huh. It was terrible. Okay. Estuvo terrible. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ok, estos son, ya son tiempos pasados, pero es solo para que ustedes tengan una idea de cómo es describir un problema. Okay, the waiter. Do you, do you remember what is the waiter? El mesero. Uh, where? Cero. Where or what? Was. What? Or bro? Was. 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 No, no llevó. Okay. Bro, bro, as. The run starters. Oh. Son como la, las las uh, las entradas, pero fueron incorrectas las entradas. The run starters. In, adi in addition, they were. they were completely full. Oh, estaban muy heladas. Uh -huh. The main course. 
Where? Was or where? I was. Was also disappointment. Mm -hmm. The, the chicken where was or is uh -huh. el pollo estaba was was rock rock estaba crudo estaba crudo right? it was rock and the beef was inedible. Mm -hmm. Do you know what is beef? La carne. Inedible. Was inedible. Uh, inedible. Inedible was not good. Okay, no estaba buena para comer. Inedible. 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 Okay. Uh -huh. When the bill, when the bill, cuando el recibo, okay, para pagar, when the bill, uh -huh, came, it, yes. it, well, it was totally wrong. I asked. Two. Yes, two. Yes, two. Yes. We speak. Speak. We speak to the manager. But I. I was well, told. Pero me dijeron. Sure. I was told he was busy. My family. Where. Estaban so upset about the meal. Estaban muy enojados. That is upset. Enojados, okay? Mm. No sé. Why is my family where or my family? Maybe are my, my family are so upset about the meal. Pero eh, fue en el pasado. Should be where? Okay, we're going to check it. Okay, I. Okay, aquí tenemos las otras formas. Aquí tenemos a would like, ajá, que hemos estado viendo esta semana. I would like, I will like, I will want, or I must, I must want. I expect. I expect es como esperar, okay? Which one do you think that is here? I expect a full refill for my meal. Or I would like. I would like. I would like. I would like. I would like a full refund. Refund is como um, es como um, un regreso, un retorno del dinero por la comida. ¿Quién quiere que le regrese? Okay. <coughs> Okay, uh, I I will like a full refund for the meal. In addition, I I will I no I I will want a letter of apology. Do you know what is apology? Disculparse. Disculparse. Ah, una, una, 
na carta dele ao Aiesé. If you have noise, please mute. If you have noise. Ok. I expect, espero, I expect a letter of apology from the manager. Ok. You're faithfully, uh -huh, Pete, Turp. Ok, eso fue como una forma de escribir un problema. Ok. Let me see if that is. Ok, good. Okay. Okay. Here you have it. Okay, pero está en tiempo pasado, será un poco confuso para ustedes, pero um, solo es como un ejemplo, pero vamos a hacer otro ejemplo en tiempo presente también. Okay. We're going to continue. Now here we have another <clears throat> letter of complaint. Tenemos otra carta. Okay, here now we have the letter. <clears throat> okay, first is the address we said. Primero era la address. Pero la address de quién? The address you are writing from or the address you are writing to. Do you remember? The address you are writing from yeah. es la dirección de don, desde donde yo estoy escribiendo. The address you are writing to es la address de la persona a quien le estoy escribiendo. Which one is first? Do you remember? The address you are writing from. Okay. Good. The, the address you are writing from. <clears throat> and the second will be? The address you are writing to. Okay. And third? Al tercero, <clears throat> ¿cuántos faltan aquí? One, two, three, four, five. The opening of the letter. Dear Mr. Smith. Okay. I'm writing to express my concern about the dangerous state of having been in the server of Clinton where I live. Okay. <clears throat> what will be? To explain why you are writing. Right? Mm -hmm. Explain why you are writing, right? Okay. Severe weather last winter caused many of the old paving stones to crack and distort so that they now provide a very uneven surface to walk on. The worst affected areas are Gloucester Lane, Queen Street, and on the corner of Victoria Avenue and Windsor Road. Okay, what is the what part will be that one? Que part is Describing the problem. Describing mm -hmm. the problem. Okay. Problem. <laughs> okay. As you well know, many retired people live in the district. And these pavements represent a particularly serious hazard for them. Walking unsteadily and perhaps suffering from poor eyesight. 
a site. An elderly person could all too easy fall and valley hurt himself. Which part is this one? I don't explain what happened. Explain okay. the action you will know. Describe the effect the of the problem, right? Okay. How I must or you take immediate action to repair the damaged paving stones in order to prevent such accidents from occurring. This is the last one. Explain what action you would like to have. Okay. Okay, let me send a, a screenshot also for this one. Le voy a mandar un screenshot for examples. Do you have questions about this? Tienen preguntas? <clears throat> uh, maybe you'll find um, a lot of new vocabulary. What is the main reason of the letter? What is the problem that is describing? Uh, problem. Uh huh. What is problem? Okay. Mm -hmm. The dangerous space of the pavement. Uh huh. The dangerous state of the pavement. Okay. The winter caused the, the, the problems, right? That are paving stones. <clears throat> okay. Uh, and, the, and the problems that he wants to avoid is that the people mm -hmm, suffer from a pan. Elderly people, elderly means las personas viejitas, okay? Los que ya no pueden ver, okay? Poor a sight means que ya no pueden ver. They may suffer and they can easily fall and badly hurt. Se pueden caer fácilmente, okay? That is the reason he wants that uh, the person, the Mr. Smith, take immediate action to repair the damaged paving stones to prevent such accidents. Okay? The paving is the paving uh the pavements son como las aceras, okay? No son realmente uh la ca las calles donde donde van los carros, sino son los lo para los pe peatones. Do you have another question for me? Una pregunta? Who wants to read the letter? Can I get a letter? Volunteers who want to read the letter, the, the complaint letter. Teacher, esas son las partes de un párrafo, las partes de una carta. Sorry, que venía oyendo, pero no, pero es que así como... De una dice. carta, de una complaint okay. letter. Ok, vamos a hacer como una complaint letter. to report a problem, okay? That is a one that you that you um, learn to do. 
take note, bueno, ya se las envié al grupo. There you have the parts of the letter and how you are going to write the letter, okay? The, this is an example, es un ejemplo nada más. Here do you have another example to start a letter. Uh -huh. Pueden comenzarla también así. I need to file a complaint. Okay, this is another way to, to start the, the letter. Or you can do it in this way. Pueden hacer también de esa forma. You can do it in this way. I'm writing to express my concern. This is another way that you can start writing, okay? Or you can start also, I'm writing to file a complaint. You can start describing the reason of the complaint, okay? Como por ejemplo este. Okay, here I have another one. We're going to order that one just to, just to practice. We're going to add the numbers, okay? Which one will be the, the, the beginning? Ese no tiene, no tiene date, no tiene address. ¿Cuál sería el, el principio in this case? What will be the first part? ¿Cuál sería el inicio? This one, right? Number one, dear, sir, or madame? Yes. Uh -huh. I'm writing, this will be number two. I am ready to complain about the enclosed shoes, which I bought, I bought from your high street shop in Gloucester. Okay, what is the main reason? The shoes, los zapatos que compró, right? Um, that is the beginning, the reason why he's going to buy. It says, uh -huh, that will be number three. I bought the shoes in the sales at the beginning of January. After a just few days, I noticed that the, the stitching, do you remember what is a stitching, right? That the stitching had come in undone at the side of one of the shoes, leaving a hole, hole, significa un hoyo, the handle on oil, leaving a hole between the sole and the upper. When I when I took the shoes back to the shop, I was told that you don't give me refunds or on sales goods. Okay, I'm describing the problem here. Okay, which one will be number four? This one, part four, this situation is obviously unacceptable. I contacted the consumer rights office and was assured that all shops are legally responsible for the quality of all goods that they sell, including sales items. I would therefore like you to refund the cost of the shoes. Please find and attach a copy of the receipt. I would also like to suggest that you make yourselves a staff more aware of their obligation to customers. Okay, what will be part number five? We are missing just this one and 
this. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Okay, espero una respuesta. Pronto. Pronto. Uh, you're faithfully sad as me. Praise God. Okay, this is six. Faithful. ¿Cómo dice it? Faithfully. Faithfully. ¿Qué significa? Um, como sinceramente. That is at the end of the, of the letter. Faithful. Mm -hmm. Let me double check. Wait. Wait. Wait for me. Wait for me. Uh -huh, like a loyal way or way that you can be trust. Uh -huh. Sinceramente. Another, it, it is another way to say us. Sinceramente. Okay. This is another example, okay, of the letter. I will send it to you as well. The way mother también al chat for you to have the examples. If you have questions, please let me know, okay? Díganme si tienen preguntas. <clears throat> Yo más te preguntas ando perdida. <laughs> no, pero uh, no, solo lo, lo principal que yo quiero es que ustedes identifiquen las partes de la carta, ¿ok? When you're going to write a complaint, digamos que, que tuvieran que escribir una, una letter, una complaint letter in your job. En su trabajo. So you will identify the, the part of the letters, okay? So now you are going to fill out a complete form. De acuerdo a la que está aquí. De acuerdo a esto, van a llenarla. Okay? Complete form. This is the, this is like a, the, the template, the form, name of the complainant. O sea, su nombre acá, date, today, okay, June 22nd. Home phone number, if you have a home phone number, teléfono de casa, work phone number, if you have a work phone number, fax number, if you have a fax number here, a street address, that will be the, the address, okay, city, your city, your email address, okay? Then we're going to start. Complaint information, describe the nature of the complaint, identify the equipment, equation of the problem. Y aquí pueden aplicar esas otras partes que ya aprendieron en los ejemplos, okay? And at the end, signature of the person making the complaint, okay? Um. Aquí tenemos como un poquito más de detalles dependiendo la dependiendo su compañía, su empresa, cómo le van, van a formular ellos la complaint form, ¿ok? Pero la forma general, general form, will be this one, ¿ok? Like a letter. So we're going to complete this form. Vamos a hacerla. Vamos a complete the form. Um, you decide, ustedes deciden qué van a, de qué se van a, a quejar, ¿ok? The, what will be the complaint? En el archivo... que ustedes reciben de, de acá. 
del curso, al final, ahí está. Si ustedes no quieren eh, trabajarlo um, en, de otra forma, se pueden ir acá y se pueden ir aquí, agregar texto y la pueden llenar directamente allí, en el archivo. ¿Y dónde encuentro ese archivo? Mm, se los enviaron a ustedes en el, en el email, pero se los voy a enviar ahorita si quieren. Si sí, impreso lo podemos hacer ahí, teacher. Si lo tiene impreso. Sí. Sí, lo puede hacer ahí. Y me okay. mandan después una fotografía, ¿ok? Una, una, solo quiero evidencia de que lo llenen. Se lo voy a enviar acá. Ok. Se lo voy a enviar acá a... Archivo. There you have it. Student manual. That is the, the name. It is in the page 46. La página 46, okay? I will give you 15 minutes, 15 minutes to complete that form, okay? Para que la llenen. Okay, we're going to write an example. But I want that you write your example, okay? Quiero que escriban el, el de ustedes. Okay. Day. Thursday. Thursday. June 2023. Oh, no, pueden inventarse uno. address you can write the address in spanish because we cannot translate it hasta la unidad 4 nos vamos a ir verdad yes
This is an ex an example, okay? Okay, now we're going to apply what we learned. ¿Qué aprendimos? Okay, vamos a aplicar ahí. ¿Qué aprendimos? To write the letter. Ya lo encontré, ya lo encontré. Okay. I am writing. This letter to file a complaint. pero no me da la opción de escribir sobre él. Eh, así como yo la tengo, no le da. No. ¿Con qué browser la está abriendo? Porque lo puede abrir con... con H. Ábralo con este browser. Porque creo que si lo abre con otro browser no le da. Por ejemplo, yo, vaya, tengo este link. Lo voy a abrir aquí con Chrome. Chrome. Ajá, si lo abro con Chrome no me da, mire, no me da la opción. Ábralo con H. Estoy intentando con este también y no, no, no se puede con Chrome. Con Chrome no, con Chrome no se puede, solo con H. No tienen este browser. Este sí, del... Yo sí lo he podido abrir, pero no encuentro la, la, el número de página. Está hasta el final, sí, sí. Delicia, hasta arriba, hasta abajo. 46. 46, ajá. Busquen el, 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 otro, el browser de H y si no lo tienen, lo, lo pueden descargar, creo yo. Quedamos en lo mismo. Mejor transcribo. Ay, padre ganado, qué calor quedó haciendo. Y no llovió. Brendadito llovió, pero más el calor que está haciendo. I'm sorry. Sorry about that. Más que me recuerdo. Lo voy a transcribir, teacher. No me toca de otra porque no, no tengo ese. ese. Ok. Mm, let me see if I can send it to you. Like, uh, web page, web capture. Mm. No tengo esa opción. Por ejemplo, si le doy acá, lo copio. Si se los envío, if I send it to you, 
se me va como imagen, pero no puede, igual no lo puede, no pueden escribir en ella. Uh -huh. Sí, es lo que pasa. Uh -huh. no. Tal vez para el lunes ya he terminado. <risa> For tomorrow. Para mi vida. No, yo no voy a pasar. <risa> ok. Ok, try to, try to feel it. Complétenla. And then you will send me, um, me van a mandar una screenshot o fotografía, ok, um, o WhatsApp. And there you are going to check it. Ahí la voy a chequear y les voy a dar su feedback. But yes, try it out to, to complete that form. Por fin lo encontré. 46, that is the page. ¿Tiene la opción de escribir? Sí. Ah. Ok. I'm writing this letter to file a complaint with my headset. Ajá. Headsets. Yo los Those are my headsets. Sorry. Estoy hablando con mi teléfono. Ah. <risa> <risa> es que no es posible que no me dé. Está viejito, pero tiene que servir. Yes, me encontré, teacher. Ok. Ya no lo puedo hablar. <risa> Para que sale muy chiquito, muy chiquito.
It has double date because I already had the date and it has another date here. No es necesario poner doble fecha, pero ajá, el, el, el complaint form has it. Okay. If this is an example, like you are going to do it, okay? Thank you. 
Hello, teacher. Hello. Este, no había podido entrar a la clase hasta ahorita. Acabo de llegar a la casa. Ok, Isabel. We are working in a complaint letter, ok? ¿Cómo? We are working in a complaint letter. Estamos trabajando en una carta. ¿En una carta? Yes. Que no se escucha porque está lloviendo bien fuerte. Ok. Yes, we are working in a letter. Estamos trabajando en una carta, en a complaint letter. He estado explicándoles cómo lo, las partes de una carta. Ok. In this case, will be a complaint letter when you want to describe a problem in a written way. Uh, there you have examples in the chat. Let me give you the chat. And here we have another example, okay? In the page, in the page 46, in the page 46, del material que ustedes tienen, que también se los, se los envía al chat. Ahí está el formato. There you have the format, the complaint format. Okay. Página 46. Ok. Esa es la que me va a llenar. Ok. Ok. Yes, you can do it in your notebook. Lo pueden hacer en su cuaderno y solo me mandan un screenshot. O lo pueden hacer en la computadora y también me mandan un screenshot. Ok, okay. ahorita hacemos eso o... o... Yes. yes, you are working on that. If you need help, 
please let me know, ok? Necesitan ayuda, me dicen. Please let me know who is um who finished, okay? Los pueden ir enviando al chat. If you finished, you can send the, the, the screenshot or picture to the chat. Un problema, teacher, vamos a describir, vean, del trabajo. Yes. Ajá, uh -huh. problem. It could be a problem with uh, your machine, con cualquier otra herramienta que ustedes utilicen en el trabajo. It could be a problem with uh, a chair, con la silla. It could be a problem with the air conditioning. Um, it could be a problem in the cafeteria. Okay. Cualquier, cualquier problema in your job, okay? A complaint that you have. Complaints que no pueden hacer allá, dijo Brenda. Que pueden hacer aquí. And I will help you. <laughs> I will help you how to write the complaint. Teacher, vamos a copiar el formato que está en la página 46 y lo vamos a llenar. Yes. Yes. Uh -huh.
How are you? How are you doing, guys? ¿Cómo eh, le va? Yo tengo una consulta. Uh -huh. En el primer párrafo yo es, pongo el problema que yo tengo, ¿verdad? Como una breve descripción, ajá. Uh -huh. Y en el segundo lo explica más detalle. Con más detalle. Y el tercero la solución que usted espera. Ok. Okay. ¿Cuánto tiempo era, teacher? ¿Cuánto tiempo? ¿Ya pasó el tiempo? Sí. If you Ay, have it, please, please send más it. Tiempo, más tiempo. Yo lo, estaba, yo lo estaba editando, pero como me moví de una ventana a otra, se perdió a ah, una imagen mejor copié. Esa estoy editando ahorita. <risa> ok, Robert. It's ok. I can give you more time. Don't worry. Le voy a dar otros um, cinco minutos. Cinco minutos. And I'm going to read it for you tomorrow. Lo vamos a leer mañana, ¿ok? Everybody is working, right? Todos están trabajando, ¿verdad? Yes, teacher. Okay. Griselda, did you finish? Griselda, did you finish? Se me fueron, como no están con cámara, ¿verdad? Sí, Cher, yo lo sí, ya lo terminé, pero lo escribí porque no pude editar la imagen. 
Y la he enviado al chat, pero no sé si se ve, la verdad. Um, se ve un poquito oscurita. Ok. Dele zoom. <ríe> Uh -huh. Okay, it says uh, name of the complaint, Griselda Velasquez, date Thursday, June 22nd, phone number, do you have the phone number, the street address, okay, then you have the complaint information, describe the nature of the complaint at the, uh-huh, I'm writing the, this letter to to file a complaint with my new application. It doesn't seem to, to work. Delete the, the data registered to the application and doesn't allow changing the password. Double S, password, okay? Okay. I would like you to review the application again and make the necessary adjustments and no have more complications. Here, your name, your signature. Okay, that is me. Okay. Yes, that is good. Good job. Good job here. Someone else that has that finish, you can send it. We can re we can check it. If not, tomorrow we are going to check all of them. Okay. Don't forget your name at the end. Okay, I have the one for Natalie and one for ID. No sé, pero aquí no les puedo dar más zoom. ¿Y can you see it? Pueden verla. It says, okay, uh, the name, the phone number, and everything, uh, the address, and then complaint information. I am writing this letter. First reason is to let you know my disagreement with my purchase of a plasma. When I when I am with my family, I try the the turn. I try ah they try they try. I try, they, no, they try, sería ahí, okay? They try turn it on, the smart, the smart TV. I need my smart TV that I bought to be able to enjoy. Joint. Mm. Ahí le falta un poco más de información, okay? You have problems with the, with the, TV because it's not turning on, right? Okay. Uh -huh. When you try to turn it on, it doesn't work. Uh -huh. ¿Qué es lo que usted espera ahí? Eso me faltó, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Lo que usted espera. What will okay. be the resolution? Una resolución. Okay. Pero trate de, de um, escribir un poquito más claro eso, ¿ok? Mm, sí, sí, sí. Ok, let me see this one. Uh, Natalie, ok, good job, good job. 
hello, good morning. I need help because my chair is ringed. The back, the backrest came lost, and my back hurts a lot, and I can't work well. Aquí sería, um, was lost, was lost, fue perdida, ok, se le perdió. Uh -huh. uh, if they can fix it, I hope they can give me a new one. Thank you very much and I hope your answer. Uh, your signature here, your name. Uh -huh. Okay. Good. Someone else? Teacher, ahí le envié ya con la con lo que me dijo que tenía que escribir al final. Okay, thank you. Let me see. <clears throat> the rest, please send me the the complaint today, okay? Envíamelo hoy para para yo revisárselos. Okay, here the signature. Thank you, Griselda. Okay. Okay, guys. Um, for tomorrow we're going to work in the uh, in the homework seventeen. No, we have seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen and twenty. Okay. Nos faltan tres o dos, ¿verdad? Please try to work if you have time for the ones that haven't finished. Algunos ya terminaron. Thank you so much. Yo todavía estoy editando. <laughs> okay, it's okay. So you can send me that later. You take your time, but send me... Send me the, the complaint letters today. Okay? Mándamelas ahora para que no les quede pendiente para mañana. Al grupo de WhatsApp. Yes, to the group. Okay. Let me see. Just I need to check your scores. Let me check your scores. Voy a revisar sus notas. Okay, I will wait for uh, your letters. If you don't have questions, that will be everything for today. Thank you so much. Don't don't forget to send me the letters to the to the chat. Okay. And tomorrow we're going to check them. Vamos a revisar mañana. Les voy a dar bien el feedback. 
if you if you have if you need feedback. See you tomorrow, guys. Tomorrow at seven p.m. Okay. Have a good night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.